Hello everybody, I'm Ernest, coming live from my RV. Today is uh, June 10th of 2024. I'm off today because I'm a federal employee. So I have the day off and I'm doing laundry and I'm making some videos. And I've been thinking about these subjects. Uh, well, this particular video is going to be, you got to have a plan when you retire. So why am I saying this? What what encouraged me to talk? And this is something that I've kind of knew within my, myself. This is what I'm doing. I'm not an expert, a, a retirement expert or anything. I'm, I'm hoping my videos come across as a forum for people in our situation and my age group to speak about things in our life. Keep life simple. <laughs> That's one. Try to anyway. Well, all right. So what do I want to talk about? All right. You, and I started to think about this over this weekend. I was talking to a friend and he have, he's been retired for a few years now. He's, he did like 28 years for uh, the Budweiser company uh distributory and um he and his girlfriend is saying that he had to go back to work because he just needed structure this being off all the time i guess he doesn't have any hobbies or other things that he had to do and just missed work and he told me that he um works for a landscaping company now and he's like a supervisor and he drives around and sees all these properties and just makes sure that the work is getting done and that if there's anything need to be corrected, he's there to correct. And he said he doesn't work a full day, you know, like five, six hours a day. And, uh, and that was enough for him to give him something to do. And, um, uh, so he would just, so he just went back to work. Well, that worked for him. For everybody else, well, that's up to you, I guess. And in, in my case, uh, I'll, I've been thinking about it, what I'm going to do. I'm hoping this, this YouTube channel is part of it. I'll have more time for YouTube. Like today, I'm off. I already made a video. It's uploading right now. And I'm going to do this video today on this subject. And who knows what else this YouTube will lead me to. That's one aspect of my retirement working out i'm always going to continue to work out i think that's very important i made several videos about that your health is your wealth which is more important than your monetary health uh if you're healthy you can make money you can go work if that's what you had to do uh, but for some people it's going to be gardening or it's going to be volunteer services you can volunteer your time. There's always all kinds of groups. Uh, like with me, I was thinking maybe the food bank or uh, some homeless shelters or something. Maybe where I can do some good. Or maybe I'll go back to work too. Uh, I have a friend that um, he trains uh, military dogs. I thought about doing that. Go and train military dogs since I have a lot of connections still with the military. I work on the military base. I retired military and I'm civil service right now, contemplating retiring next July, August probably. I turned 62 in July 27th, so of next year. And um, so um, that is what my current situation is. Well, what else? I mean, travel, okay, so some people say you can travel. Some people say, move to the Philippines, move to Mexico, move everywhere. Uh, I may travel those places, but uh, I don't know about living overseas. I have two young daughters, and plus I don't want to be away from them too long. I love them dearly, and uh, uh, I would like to have them in my life. It's, you know... And until they they get married and they start their own family and everybody knows how that goes and things just start to happen and 
you just get your own life, you know. I guess that's the way we're supposed to do it. And um, so we'll see how that goes. But everybody has a different plan. I, it's not going to be, hopefully, get caught sitting on the sofa like I'm doing now. Watching Netflix or uh, doing those kind of activities. Uh, yes, there'll be times I'll do that. And uh, but I don't want to get caught in that circle. It's toxic to just sit there and just binge watch or just not do much of anything. Just just your mind goes numb. Your body goes numb. You know, you got to keep using this stuff, you know, to keep it going. Um, and so I plan to do these hobbies or YouTube, um, a whole combination of things. But I'm definitely going to have something to do. Uh, I'm not going to wait for the Grim Reaper to come. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I just thought I'd make this video and we can comment down below. I, I do read the video. Uh, comments and plus other people on this channel like to communicate back and forth with uh diff sharing their stories and different situations going on in their life see how long is that uh i'm at six minutes and, a, and 40 seconds okay well i think that's enough i think uh just a little short video about having a plan uh and all the different options that you can do. Maybe you're a church person and you can volunteer at your church. Uh, some of us are going to have grandbabies. I'm, I'm not one of them, by the way. Hopefully not for a long time. Uh, help raise our grandkids. Be involved with our kids. Uh, be involved with our community. Uh, and just... Finding a zest for life, having a reason to get up in the morning to like, what am I going to accomplish today? I need to accomplish something, not every day, but some days. And uh, those are the things that I look forward to do. And right now I got to go accomplish my laundry because I think the dryer is about to to time out and go some fold some clothes. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.